Alright guys, I've just been working on a MIDI device so I can sync to this. You see there's uh, the Game Boy going to the breadboard and then you've got the MIDI cable going did somewhere. There we go. To one of these, which is going to that. Ugh, it's been fun so far, I just just to show you it works, it's it was a pretty fun build and it's fun to mess around with. Just uh this keyboard. Okay. Yeah. It's uh what I've done is I've put in just some simple monophonic lines. You've noticed as you can see there which I'm just gonna which I'm leading out to the Game Boy, which is going from the MIDI channel. I don't know if you like Ableton. And as you can see there. Da -da 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 -da. Going on channel one. I just uh, just put in a drum beat so you can sh see that the Game Boy sound syncs up. I've taken the sound output from the Game Boy and plugged it into my amp. It's I don't know if you're, if the sound will match up. We'll see what happens. Oh, what am I doing? Oh, I guess I haven't synced the buttons. Oh, I switched the thing off. That's why. My fault. All right. Ah, whatever. I have to do it by mouse click. See, it's sick it up. Alright, that's just a little show. But um, the Game Boy is also synced to be in time to all the. Because it's sending out signals, obviously it's going to be in time with Ableton, so I'll just speed up. And go around like, I think, 500 beats per, beats per minute, it's okay with. I'll bring it back down. I've got some uh, random things going. Anyway, that's it's fun. Oh wait, let's try and air it out. Anyway, I was stopping. That was fun. That's uh, that's MIDI for a Game Boy to signals. There are lots of CC inputs that it can take that I haven't messed around with yet. But uh, I've been making a few of these. It's fun. Anyway, that was that's a demonstration. <laughs> Take it easy.